Due to a steep increase in decentralized generation in the medium and low voltage networks, the need to verify such connections according to regional standards is also rising. In Germany, these points are summarized under the BDEW recommendations. PSC Sinkal now offers the ability to automate all necessary calculations for a grid code compliance assessment using one simple module. Furthermore, the module produces finished documentation which can be handed in for grid conformity assessment processes. In this example network, we will assess the connection of this wind generator. Other generator types which are included in the BDEW recommendations can also be assessed by PSS Sinkal. For example, hydro generation, photovoltaic. The generator in question is to be connected to the network directly at the point in the network to be assessed. Right click, choose calculation at element, verify connection condition. A wizard now starts where all necessary data for the grid compliance assessment is gathered. In project data, the details of the project can be entered for documentation purposes. Network type selects the network level of the generator. Depending on voltage level, the relevant technical guidelines will be used in the assessment. Max terminal active power is the sum of the terminal active power of all generation units. In this iteration, we will check the connection of 2 megawatt active power. Power factor of the generator at this power level can be entered. If not equal to 1, the generator needs to be set to be a reactive power supplier or consumer. Power factor is for documentation purposes. The fields max utilization line and max utilization transformer determine the max utilization in the load flow calculation. Generating unit type is for documentation. If the number of generating units is greater than one, the model contains multiple generating units. The active power of the largest generating unit can be entered here. This value can be used in the assessment of harmonics, flicker and fast voltage changes. The fields manufacturer, model and type determine how harmonics of multiple generating units will be added. The controller characteristic is determined by these three points. Turn the assessment of flicker and harmonics on by ticking here. The flicker coefficients can be entered in the table. Flicker will be calculated for the given wind speeds. For the harmonic calculation, the harmonic currents are first to be entered in the element in the tab Harmonics. This data determines how the BDEW recommendations are to be applied with respect to harmonics. Here, the factors for the fast voltage change can be entered. Now start the calculations. An overview of the results are available in Results view. Here the input data can be seen. The results of the assessed categories are summarized, and it is immediately clear that the tests for slow and fast voltage change have not been passed. The detailed results are compiled in a Word document. Click on Show Documentation. On Document Cover page is the Project General Information. Then comes the Contents page. In the first section, a summary of results is displayed as well as the overall results. Connection data contains the main grid connection data. The detailed results of the various tests is in the section Assessment of the Network Connection. In section 3.2, a check is made if overloads occur due to the extra generator. The entered limits for maximum utilization is applied. Section 3.3 contains the assessment for permissible voltage changes. The voltage change and maximum infeed at the connection point, as well as the point in the network with maximum voltage change, is found. These subtests are passed if the maximum voltage change in the network is below the permissible limit. Network disturbances are looked at in section 3.4. The fast voltage changes caused by connecting and disconnecting generating units is assessed. Long-term flicker is checked. Harmonics are evaluated against maximum limits for related harmonic current. In the following iterations, the connection data, for example active power to be connected or connection point in the grid can be modified until the tests are passed. 